Welcome to another episode. Well, this is uh, not just any episode. It's uh, I'm going to do something a little bit different here, and hopefully it works. I haven't tested it. I haven't tried to do it. I've literally just walked from the club where I learned this and uh, trying to bestow my best wisdom. So, what I did tonight was I got Ultramile, and because that's my tried and true humidity proof, sweat proof, everything proof, and I got. Um, Versace Eros, which, as much as I love, I'm not in love with. So, I obviously used a little bit more um, JPG Ultramol, but I had a chance to spray um, Versace Eros as well. And, I, I mean, it's very humid today, and they were a bit overpowering. I was a, a little trigger happy, you could say, but here's why. So check this out. I'm going to turn off the lights, and in a few magical seconds, you're going to see the biggest problem I've found wearing white t-shirts and spraying John Paul Gaultier Ultramar. Okay, if we look here, that's from the Ultramar. So when you go into like a strip club or a disco, you have a very, very noticeable dot on a white shirt. So what I did, ooh, check this out here. What I did oh, to uh, just make it a split test day, because it was a write-off, it's some public holiday, and they're not selling beer as often as they normally do. I sprayed the other shirt with a Versace Eros to see if it did the same thing. Now let's have a look. As you can see, there is no noticeable coloration difference. Whereas on this side, you can just fucking see that thing. So, so this begs the question, is this a bad thing? No. First of all, one, you, you, this is the two, just to, you know, which, it's his ass, just turn him around. So, one, you don't wear white shirts all the time. Just be aware, you can do a few things. A, spray your skin. B, spray further away. Um, well, that's basically it. Then, is it, is it worth, though? You need to go to penis. Is it worth uh, switching from Ultramile to uh, Versace Eros? No, I still like Ultramile a lot better. Um, I mean, the smell on this is great, but it doesn't... It's not as mass appealing, I would say, in Thailand, at least. People will actively not like Eros, but almost nobody apart from men, which, frankly, is a great thing, because I don't want them hanging around smelling me. Um, People love, or well, girls love, Ultramile. So, I mean, you can see how much I've used. I mean, can you? Little, yeah, I've <laughs> used like nothing. This is 125. I spent nothing on it. Well, not really nothing. I spent like um, 80 Australian dollars, which is 55 US dollars <clears throat> on a massive bottle, duty free. I'm, I'm still a huge Ultramile supporter. So, if you've got a choice and you're wearing a white shirt, Unless you want to get stains that show up basically only, because look, this is not UV light, you can't see it. But if you're going in under UV light, it's something to be very, very aware of. Until next time.